Now for this portion of the demonstration, we're going to go through the process of installing or deploying that TCP relay node. Now, as you can see here, once again, I have remotely connected to my management node to find the deployment. We're going to get, we're going to copy it and drop it into our Centrify folder. And now that that's completed, we'll go ahead and exit Windows Explorer and we'll go into PowerShell. So from here, let's go ahead and expand the archive once again. We'll go into the folder. And now we're ready to deploy the TCP relay. Now, it's important to remember that with the web node, background node, TCP relay, and even the log relay, uh, you're going to use the same steps if you have to scale and deploy additional nodes. Uh, the important aspect here to remember is that layer 4 load balancer. So if you're going to deploy multiple nodes in your enterprise production environment, that load balancer becomes very, very important so it can balance the traffic properly and keep the solution healthy. So let's go ahead and continue on by deploying the TCP relay. Centrify dash pause dash deploy. This will be relay node and the ID will be TCP relay one. And as you can see, the TCP relay has now been deployed. So let's move over to the log relay next before we complete the deployment.